Huh? Where the hell am I? Who am I? <sighs> it's a nice time video. Hey, what's up, everyone? So, I just got a new dorm room, and it's really cool. Um, shout out to my friend, um, aka Whopper, the person who's actually been a few in a few of my videos. Um, uh, he just changed his name because we also do because we're also doing a role play right now. Yeah. He made all of this, and he also made probably, and he also made the um, YouTube um, profile picture, aka this right here. You should probably see that in the um, profile picture of the YouTube channel. Yeah, uh, if you want a little uh, rundown, here's how it goes. Um, so basically, um, we got a TV, we got some books, because, for no reason, because he added that. And also, um... Shut up. And also, we got a bed where, of course, like, you go see, sit in here so it looks like you're actually sleeping. Then down here, you can actually see a lot of stuff here. And, of course, like, we go right here. We have a whole entire um, cool um, PC. And we also ha made a hollow tower. So, of course, like, like, we could do this. It was really cool. And I just want to show you how it all works and how it all runs down. Uh, so let's see how it looks. It was a lot. So first of all, right here we got um, an audio player and a trigger volume. Basically, when a player enters, that means it'll play. And of course, if the player exits, it will pause. So basically, for example, if I just exit this room right here, it will stop the music permanently. Also, since my friend is smart, they of course um, actually did a really good job trying to do this. And also, shout, also, since my friend is really good at animation, she decided to make this right here. Using a text screen, they decided to make this. It was really cool. And, of course, suddenly, um, we got this, too. And we all don't, of course, leave the spawn point. Don't forget about that. This was all the old parts of it. And, of course, suddenly, um, how to make an infinite chip. It's how to make an infinite holotar. It's like a, this is a variable chip, and then put it connected to it. Yeah. That's all, and of course, don't forget these lights. These are basically like a spinning, rotating light that will make sure they shine out the room so it looks like this. Also, um, yes, these are variable chips to get connected. This one right here, this is connected from the mouse to the holotar, so which means if you move it, it will like keep stay with it. And also made it, and they also made the room kind of darker by putting this here. Uh, yeah, this all looks really cool. Um, thank you, Whopper, for helping me out on this really cool video. I really don't have to say because we're already on a Discord right now. Um, also, um, also, sorry for not posting that much. I've been kind of sick for a while. Well, and I had a lot of school to do. Or maybe I was just bored and did a lot of cool stuff and enjoyed some friends. Yeah, but also, don't forget... Yo, Rector Plus. And when you click it, um, it'll... Rector Plus membership. I'm uh, thinking, um, probably what's next is I'm gonna change this rec sensor door with something a lot cooler and chiller. Yeah. So, yeah, that's everything. Thank you, Whopper, aka Peppy and all right now. Um, helping me out for this, and, uh, see y'all later. Make sure to subscribe to... And bye-bye.